the video. The video that you put your guess, your very educated guess about which state we have chosen to live. <laughs> right? Yes. Even if for some horrible reason this house falls through, we have still chosen to live in this state. For a few reasons. Okay. So, here's what you do. You put... What are you staring at me for? I'm not staring. I'm looking and admiring. Oh. Just keep talking. You're doing good. Okay. Don't, don't get sidetracked. She forgot what she was <laughs> going to say. She... She got sidetracked. Okay. So put down... You want to start over? No, I'm good. You got it? Okay. Put down below in this video. This in is your the comments. only in the video comment section. that counts. In the comment section. Put down which state you believe we are going to go and live in. And you can vote, do it for one week, seven days actually. No, you can't do it for you have one week to do it. Yeah. Till next Wednesday, Wednesday at, at the five Eastern time. Eastern time. The five p.m. Eastern time at our next live. Well, no, we need to set it earlier than that because you have to print out and put them on slips of paper. Oh, you hadn't thought that through yet. Okay. So let's make it Tuesday night at midnight. You want me to stamp till midnight? No, no, no. Oh. <laughs> no, you can see the time stamp on, on Wednesday morning. and then Tuesday night at midnight. Tuesday night at midnight is the deadline. That's different than what we said, but Tuesday, this is where you're the hearing 27th. the final rules. The 27th. The 27th. That is the 27th. On the 28th. Midnight. We will pick the name. Now, if there's... If you're the only person who guessed the state that we're going to be no in... There's no drawing. We don't have to draw. But if several people choose the same state, we're going to take the people that guess the correct state, put it, in, put their names into a bowl, and draw one of their names out on our live. At so, who's going to be the non-biased person that draws the name? You are. Okay. He, he never knows what's going on. <laughs> well, he didn't today because he worked about twelve hours. <laughs> She's not real happy about that. <laughs> She's not. <laughs> okay. She's going to have to talk to my boss. <sighs> okay. So, there is some gifts that we're going to give to the people who... The person who guessed right. The first no, the, one... The, 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 the person who guessed right and gets chosen. And gets that. chosen. Yeah. Okay. You may need to... Well, this is... Yeah, see? Put it down. This is an egg apron. This was made by Tamara from Tamara's Creations. And I'll show you a video right now about when she met up with me at the Homesteaders of America conference. I was there too. I met her too. Today is the day that I'm going to highlight Tamara's Creations. Tamara is a person who came to Jim and I at the Homesteaders of America conference. And she told me that she had wanted to bring me something. This is Tamara, and this is Tamara's Creations. She'd been in correspondence with me about meeting her here, and she gave me a different one, but this is an egg apron. So you put it on, and you stick your eggs in it. And this is what she does. And this is the apron that she made for me. So it's got enough for 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. A dozen eggs to fit into this apron. I cannot wait to have chickens to try it again. She also makes them that come down this far so it can have another layer, so 18 eggs. And then she um, makes them for small children makes them small for children. This is one that we're going to do in an upcoming giveaway that Hardiness Approach is going to do with our subscribers. And it also holds a dozen. And then they're just sweet. So how long have you been doing this? Um, probably about 
three months. Three months. Yeah, my grandma taught me how. She's only been doing this for three months. Three months. Okay, so I start something and kind of go, Ooh, okay, three months. And she had a bag full of them. I'm gonna put her information online so that you can order these from her. And she will make you or a longer one or a smaller one for your kids. And I'll have some that I'm gonna show you. And we're gonna have a giveaway where we give away one of her aprons. <laughs> So I'm really happy to meet you. Oh, thank you so much. <laughs> oh. Okay, it's true. Going into that. The other two gifts are my two books that I've written. This is a children's book called Find Joy. It's illustrated. Full like, color illustrated. Full color illustrations. It's fun. It's good. It's a good story. It's an excellent story. Fun story. And this is called Voices from My Heart. It is, I'll just read one little thing in the very beginning. Um, when I saw the sadness and despair on the faces of many seniors, I knew there had to be something I could do to relieve their depression. Therefore, I sat by their side one by one and read to them, cheered them up, let them vent, listened to them, validated their feelings, and lovingly became their friend. That was my trademark as a nurse. However, now I want to do more, and these stories that I have read, that I read to them, and are written by me. After many requests from people, my stories have finally been put in book form. And so, if you're a caregiver, if you're an older person like me, growing up in the better part of your life, if you have parents you're taking care of, or, you still or if have you parents? know someone who fits into one of those categories who could use a wonderful gift. This is that book. So these two books and That was an advertisement, but it's also going to be what goes into the, the prize. Yeah, the books are available on Amazon under my name. So um, anything else that we haven't told them? You can only vote once if you no, do. You, you can vote as many times as you want. Only the last one counts. But don't encourage them to vote more than once. That makes my life really hard. She needs something to do. <laughs> not really. That is so not true. <laughs> then this is the last part. We are not closing on our house until April 25th. So we're breaking all of our rules and letting you guys know the state that we are well, moving to. We don't jinx it. Um, if for some reason it falls through, we're still going to move to that state. It will just take us longer. But we invoke your prayers on our behalf as our fellow homesteaders so that we might be able to get the home that we want and have So at one point we didn't make clear here, I think we made it in the live, but we can make clear here is that on Wednesday the 28th, at during our live at five mm -hmm. eastern time is when we are going to reveal the location we are going to announce it then yeah if you cannot make it there and your name is drawn you will still get the prize and does that cover everything seems like it hopefully it does we might have left something out but we'll be fair <laughs> all right the let let the voting begin. There we go.